the main camera of the Google Nexus 5 is certainly not a powerhouse. But even worse is the Google Camera app. That is what really destroys any chance to enjoy taking a good shot. At least until now. Yesterday Google released an update for the Google Camera app and I can tell you that it's not just about look and design. On that side everything has changed however. Now we have a full black band to shoot instead of a single virtual button. The shutter is on the right and it's easier to use and you can tap to focus without taking the shot. With the little toggle near the shutter you access an easy menu for front facing camera, flash, HDR, grid and exposure. Then, swiping from the left, you find the entire menu with Photosphere, that usually works fine, Panorama, and the switch from camera to video and vice versa. But the really blowing mind feature is Lens Blur, Google's way to get HTC U focus feature or Nokia refocus. This feature is very cool once you get out to lift the phone properly to take the shot. Basically, the camera takes a 3D depth map of the scene and then blurs away some pixels based on depth location and focus point. As you can expect, most of the time the effect is not that good, especially if the main object is not far away enough from the back. But if you take a picture of very precise objects or scenes, it's actually not that bad. With this update, there is no manual white balance and no timer, and you can take shots while filming. On one side we have new features, and on the other side we have the loss of other useful basic features. So what do you think? Is it worth to lose something to get a funnier, faster and prettier experience? Or you will stay with the old app and avoid the upgrade? As always, thanks for watching.